Hello YouTube, my name is Multiman, if you didn't already know that, probably did. And today I'm going to be talking to you a bit about this channel and some stuff that's been um, happening to me. And uh, good updates for this channel, at least I think so, and stuff that I've bought recently that helps uh, with this channel. First up, I hope you noticed at least, I have a face now. Before in my other videos, my head was cut off and just showing my torso or whatever was appropriate at that moment. And now I've decided to put my face on YouTube, so that means better for you because it's better talking and you know it, it feels more personal. And it just gives a, bit, a lot better feel to the videos if you're you know depending on what type of video you're supposed you're trying to do, but it gives a lot better feel for these talking videos like this. The reason I am showing my face totally just going to keep it to myself uh, because I like my privacy, uh, but its main reason it's good news for you because of more talking. Okay, second up is changes to this channel. Now, when I started this channel to begin with, um, my main focus was toy reviews, and that was because I was buying toys. You know, when I was younger, I was buying toys, and I was, uh, that was content that I could put onto YouTube. And that's why I chose it, because I was buying new stuff, and I was like, okay, I can review this, and I have a, you know, a pretty steady stream of stuff to come in and review. Now that I'm getting a little older, I'm not buying as many toys, and so uh, that's why you kind of see my videos just go take a, take a take, basically take a nosedive, because, I haven't been buying any toys, and so that means the content, I'm not buying any more content. Uh, I haven't been buying toys because I just, you know, I have all the things to buy, which I'll get here in a second. But go back to the history of this channel. The reason I started this channel to begin with is because I know a lot of stuff, okay? I'm not going to brag here. I'm, this is, I'm not considering this bragging, okay? I'm considering this factual analysis, if that makes any sense. But I know a lot of stuff. Okay, I can knit, I can crochet, I can sew, I can needlepoint, I can embroider, um, you know, I do YouTube stuff, I'm interested in movies, cinematography stuff, I like photography, um, you know, I can, I play soccer, baseball, I did play baseball, I did play basketball, um, shoot, I thought there was one more, uh, I did do, I am currently skateboarding as well, uh, I lear I'm learning coding, I was learning coding the other day, that was a while ago, I really want to get back into that though. Uh, it was JavaScript, I think, and I also build, I can build computers, I keep up with the tech stuff. I just do a lot of stuff, and I kind of have a really general knowledge. Also, I like I like carpentry, I like to work with wood, I like to work with, you know, just concrete, uh, metal, which because I'm planning to uh, do some welding, I can solder, I get a, get into the electronics side of it. You know, it's, I, I have a lot of different corners that I get into. Because on the one side I can knit and the other side I, I go and skateboard. So I kind of wanted to spew out all that information out onto one central channel because I noticed on other channels, you know, it's kind of like, okay, this is a tech channel, this is a toy review channel, this is the knitting and crocheting channel, and this is the, you know, the dodgeball channel or whatever. You know, every channel had a specific subject that they covered. Uh, or maybe two subjects that are kind of related to each other, or maybe three, all kind of relating to each other though. What I wanted to do was I wanted to make a channel that was just whatever information I had inside my head and just kind of spew it out to the general public on there on YouTube. Now, I know there are definitely videos that I'm going to make that have already been made, but I wanted to give my presentation on them because first off, I'm a guy, okay, I'm giving a knitting versus crocheting, which is a video I'm working on right now, you know, presentation on knitting versus crocheting, which one is better. And I don't see any videos on knitting or crocheting about guys doing it, like at all. So I, and people do, and guys do do it. I've actually know a few people that do crocheting. I know a guy that knits, knew a guy that knits. And you know, it's, I'm just kind of giving a different presentation because I'm the diff, of the different gender. And mostly, you know, the stuff that I know that are common with the opposite gender, I do. And I wanted to get that out is because, you know, who cares? You know, guys can go and sew and there's plenty of guys that are, you know, that design clothing and sew their own clothes or knit or crochet or do whatever the heck they want to. So I wanted to get that. That was half the reason, or not half the reason, probably like a quarter of the reason. But the other reason is just because I really want to make videos and I have a bunch of content already up here and I, all I have to do is just spew it out. So there are definitely going to be changes to this channel and it's going to be shying away from toys most likely. If I have a toy that I really, really like, I can go and review it. But again, it's just gonna be whatever I think of. And if you don't like that, that's perfectly fine. You know, If you really like the toy reviews 
and I'm really not gonna be doing those anymore and you don't like my channel anymore because of it, that's perfectly fine. Um, I totally accept that I'm probably gonna lose almost all my subscribers because of this or you know, just not like actually physically lose them, but just kind of like mentally lose them. If you get what I mean, they just kind of push me off from the corner because I'm not doing anything anymore. And that's perfectly fine because I'm changing my audience and if you don't like that, then uh, that's fine, go away because I'm going to grab a different audience. So anyway guys, that's about all I have to say here. I know I kind of turned into a video about just discussing what the future is of this channel, but that was really the main reason I made this video because my, my channel is gonna be changing and uh, I just wanted to let you know. A couple other things that I did recently offhand, I bought a Canon Rebel T5i, link it in the description if you want to go look at it. Very, very popular beginner camera for cinematography, photography, you know, and YouTube content creating like, like I'm doing right now. And I'm absolutely loving it. I also bought a new microphone, you probably see right there, Sony. It was a Sony lav mic. I'll put another link in the description. It was only like 15 bucks and it's a really solid microphone for $15 because I'm going to be talking more. I decided I was gonna get that. Another thing is I bought a, I didn't buy a green screen, I made a green screen. This is out of green, super ridiculously bright green poster board that I just um, taped on to some, uh, a PVC pipe frame. And it's working okay. There's some shadows um, between the cracks there that I have to get rid of because it's fooling with the, the green screen software. But otherwise it works pretty good and I was gonna use those for talking videos as well. And then also I did try Adobe Creative Cloud for a month and I can't say that I didn't like it because I absolutely love it. I just grabbed the microphone the microphone cord there. Uh, but I absolutely loved it. I was previously using PowerDirector something or other. I can't remember what it is. Very, very good video editing software for the beginner. For the beginner, that's key word there because I'm not really a beginner anymore. I've used the crap out of that thing and basically pushed it to the limits that I could possibly do. And I just can't do this stuff as fast or as easy as I can in Premiere Pro. Premiere Pro isn't as user friendly, but it gives you a lot more options to do stuff and a lot more quicker. So bottom line there is basically I'm going to be getting the Creative Cloud, a whole Creative Cloud suite if you want to call it and pay the 50 bucks a month or whatever it is to uh, rent that, I guess you want to call it. Uh, but yes, I'm very excited for that because it's a really big thing. I could deal with my old Sony camcorder that I was using before this Canon camera if I had video editing software that I could actually work with and it was, it's really exciting. I mean, that's probably the most thing, the biggest thing I'm excited for. So anyway guys, I hope this helped you out. If you kind of just end this conversation about which, what am I gonna do? Cause I've just basically been totally silent for like eight months. Mostly that was because I moved and I really haven't been motivated to do any videos. I mean, I totally moved. I moved like two states away. So it was a pretty big adjustment. But anyway, uh, I have a Beheaded Nerfer channel, Beheaded Nerfer channel, which is linked in the description for a, this is a Nerf channel, and I'm not really doing anything on that now because I'm not buying any Nerf guns either. Uh, but main ch the other channel that I'm really trying to get up and going is the Psycho Cyclops channel, another link in the description. And that is a skateboarding slash kind of random skit channel. So if you want to like kind of see some randomness, then you can go there. And uh, yeah, I guess that's all I have to say. Uh, one quick thing before I go is that, well, let me cover this up here. This is what Amazon sent in the mail today. A Minion box. This is awesome because I absolutely love Minions and the Minion movie coming out I'm really excited for. And this is like a collector's item for me basically. I just thought that was really cool. And uh, yeah, I'm probably talking too much so um, see y'all in the next video guys.